Peace, everybody. What's up? What's up? Hey, we're back. We're back here. And, uh, yeah, they're gone. It's gone. Yeah. <sighs> Not so much a new year, new me, but, uh, ain't my father's numerology going into a one year. We just left a nine year. So, big changes. <laughs> kind of, I kind of saw it as a reset. And, um, <laughs> basically, um, we just got out of Mercury retrograde yesterday. So I was waiting for that too, before I posted this video. And um, I hope everybody will share this video, make it go viral. So today, I'm finally gonna tell the game. I'm going to tell the game instead of selling it. So take this information and run with it like People usually don't fuck up like this. Like most people will sell you this information. This is information that is to be sold, honestly. Should be selling it, but I'm not, I'm telling it. All right. So y'all are y'all in for a treat. So I don't know how many people out there suffer from a condition known as nearsightedness. It's also called myopia. Now basically what that is is um you can't see stuff that's far away. Usually, that'll be a result of uh, your weak weak eye muscles. So you need to strengthen your eyes and cleanse them out. So if you have myopia or nearsightedness, what you're going to want to uh, get, very important thing to get, is uh, a pair of these. You see, they got little holes in them. These are called pinhole glasses. And basically what they do is they make your eyes go in and out of focus a lot. In and out of focus, in and out of focus, in and out, in and out. So it's training your eyes to, you know, look at far distances and refocus when you when you look at far distances. That's that will strengthen the muscles in your eyes that um are causing the nearsightedness. Um yeah, pinhole glasses, very important very very important you can buy these um online they're not that expensive at all um i had gotten a pair off of amazon i mean i know a lot of people feel iffy about supporting amazon or whatever uh wherever you can find these glasses get them uh it really doesn't matter where you get them from um i don't know any uh black businesses that are selling these uh one day i guess if it comes up to it, I guess I'll make them one day if uh, if I'm honored to do that. Um, another very important thing that you're going to need is this. This is some Eyebrite. I got it. It's still hot. All right. I got it uh, prepared. So Eyebrite. That's also, I don't know if you see Dr. Sebi Eyewash. That's... Um, that's the same exact thing. That's the only ingredient in the Dr. Sebi eye wash. And I mean, y'all already know how I feel about that situation. Um, you know, you know, obviously I love I love the elder. I love the prophet, Dr. Sebi. That uh man changed my life completely. I have the utmost respect for him and you know, he was a very ethical guy, but he's not around anymore. Although Pablo is free, so I don't know. I'm still still not, you know, buying their products. I'm navigating through the matrix, I guess you could say. And, you know, I've been supporting Mom Pill. I will come up with a review with that real soon. Real soon. Yeah. But anyway, this is the eye bright. So basically the ratio is um eight ounces of boiling uh either distilled water or spring water to about two teaspoons of the powder of the eye bright powder you could find it uh you know a lot of places look for a wild crafted you know i found uh, i can find it on amazon i've seen it on amazon i haven't bought any of it from amazon um this is still leftover stock from the dr sebi days yeah this stuff lasts a while yeah it lasts a while you got a, you get a lot of uses out of it a whole lot of uses but yeah, the eye bright, very important. What that's going to do is it's going to strengthen the mucous membrane in your eyes. And you're going to just be pulling globs of mucus out of, you know, here and here. It's just 
it's going to be coming out like lots of it. So the pinhole glasses, the eye bright, and possibly the most important part. Oh, I guess they're all kind of equally important uh, is the diet. Yeah. Um, you're going to want to increase uh, your intake of iron and beta carotene and um, zinc. Those are going to be like the three main things that you want to increase uh, your intake in. Um, me personally, I'm a vegan. Um, so I don't eat no meat. I don't eat dairy, eggs, any of that stuff. Um, try to keep it alkaline. Um, there's a lot of people that have uh, differences and disagreements with certain things. A general rule of thumb is uh, try to get your food as natural as possible. Um, don't try to get things that are too over hybridized. If it's obvious that it's a hybrid, you know, like a tangelo or one of those ugly fruits, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, what the hell is it? It's like, it's, it looks like a, a Franken fruit. I forgot what it's called. I don't know if it's ugly fruit. I don't think it's ugly fruit. I forgot what it's called, but stay the hell away from that type of stuff. Um, anything that's not natural, stay away from, uh, abstain from alcohol. That's very mucus forming, especially in the eyes, ear, and throat. Anything that will uh, cause excessive mucus in the eyes, ear, and throat, stay away from that. Because, as you know, the mucus and the inflammation does not help at all. So, you get your eye bright, your pinhole glasses, these, these looking things, you know. And you got your food. And... I don't know how long it'll take you, okay? It's going to vary for each person how long it's going to take, but let me tell you, you can reverse this stuff if you do those three things and you stay consistent with it every single day. You stay vigilant. All right, so you're going to want to look for beta carotene. Uh, you're going to get that in your squashes. All right, um, acorn squash, calabaza squash, um, you know, it's got orange. This has got orange. Stay away from carrots, though. All right, that's, that's very um, acidic and uh, hybridized. And I don't like how they taste anyway, honestly. I hate carrots. Like, I never liked how they tasted. They're just, they're like, sweet. They're, they're, they're like, chewy semi-sweet rocks like I, they did never tasted good to me ever but you want to get your beta carotene from squashes you want to eat quinoa okay quinoa that's also good for the eyes you want to eat berries blueberries elderberries you want to get um you know the nutrients that are, your eyes are composed of that's what you need beta carotene is going to strengthen um your cornea and the eye bright will also do the same thing. The eye bright has beta carotene in it. So you're going to definitely want to use that. Now, for those people wondering how do you use the eye bright? All right, so basically when you put it in the cup like this, you know, you put the two uh, teaspoons of the eye bright and the, the boiling spring or um, distilled water into the cup. You let it sit for about 15 to 20 minutes and um, you strain it out and you pour it into shot glass or uh, a little anything that can hold about say about like that much liquid like a shot glass or one of those little medicine caps and you're gonna take it you're gonna put your eye over it about 60 seconds and then you're gonna switch to the next one you toss it out and then you do it at night. So you do it two times um, out the day, 60 seconds each eye. And like, you will notice the difference. Um, these, these bad boys, you put them on, don't take them off. Like, the longer you keep them on, the better, you know, the faster your recovery will be. The more your eyes will kind of, you kind of force your eyes to, to fix themselves so consistency and persistence 
is key here. And another factor, like I had said in my previous videos, um, the first video that, <coughs> <coughs> excuse me, that it got, you know, I guess a lot of views that a lot of people were like introduced. And, you know, there's a lot of questions that was asked of me that I didn't answer at the time. And I know it's been like almost a year since I put that video out. I apologize for, um, I guess, I hope I'm making things clear with this one. Um, just people asking me, uh, I guess, what tools or what tricks to use to really uh, beat this thing. Now, those are the three things I say are very important. Also, sunlight um, and being happy. Being happy, uh, sunlight, um, positive energy. Um, yeah, I mean, all that stuff matters a lot. All that stuff is very critical to your recovery. Um, you will see, uh, I mean, at least I've, I've experienced seeing, uh, floaters, mm -hmm. seeing little squigglies, uh, here and there. They'll, it's, it's not, it's not permanent. It's, it's temporary. And in fact, that's just the mucus in the back of your, your eyes. That's what you're seeing. That's what those little squiggly lines and all that weird looking stuff that you'll see. Um, at least that I've seen cause, um, I had a pretty bad, so this eye, um, yeah, it was, it was blind, legally blind. Like, I'm not bullshitting you. Legally blind in this eye, I was. Not anymore. But, yeah, I was. And, um, I mean, I still, honestly, I still wear these. Uh, you know, every once in a while, not as much. But, um, if, <laughs> look, I'm not going to stop. Uh, you know, if it's going to keep improving, I don't know. Who knows? I mean... I know that uh, this eye could definitely, uh, you know, still see improvements. It's not uh, exactly, exactly perfect, but I don't need glasses no more. I tell you that. I tell you that. I walk confidently without the glasses. I can see the street signs. You know what I'm saying? I see pretty much. I mean, I definitely see better than most people see because, I mean, unfortunately, a majority of people can't see. Um, you know, really, my friends can see better than me, but I mean, they can see, they have, they have the most incredible eyesight out of anybody I know, honestly. But, um, yeah, just, um, stay vigilant, get a pair of these, get that eye bright, eat the alkaline foods, uh, increase the beta carotene, increase the, increase the quinoa, and, um, just believe. Now, a lot of people are probably going to say that this is pseudo. I don't care. Look, if it's pseudo, it's pseudo. If it works, spread it. I'm not somebody that's into the ego. So, um, reach one, teach one. Send this around. Um, I'm, I'm really trying to help the people here. And this is information that um, I should be selling, that should be sold should not be told and I'm telling it because I love y'all and it's a, it's a problem this is a serious problem that you know people have that a lot of people have been asking me about and I felt like now that we're out of the mercury retrograde we're in a, a one year we're in you know this prevalent time and I, I'm trying to really stay away from the, the gossip and I'm trying to really stick with the information here I'm trying, you know what I'm saying? I'm not perfect. I'm trying here. And this 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 is hopefully set the tone for 2017 and the hereafter. Um coming with real information, real straight information. So like I said, get these. These are called pinhole glasses. You can find them on Amazon. They're less than ten dollars. Uh, I had a pair from that I got from China. It was like two fifteen. Uh, the only problem was it took like a month to get here. <clears throat> I broke that pair though, so that pair is gone. Um, like this is another pair I bought, but um, yeah, these glasses, that eye bright, the diet, uh, positive people, lots of water. I mean, that should be a given. Lots of water. Um, yeah, y'all got this. 
seriously um if this video helps you send it you know somebody that's, that that that's got uh nearsightedness myopia send them this video uh do whatever it takes to um spread the word seriously i'll catch y'all later love all y'all peace